says a snake in here, guys. And the security guy. Are you hitting him? <laughs> James, why are you running? <laughs> Y'all get him? He, they said a snake came in here. He got him, babe? That's what y'all get for leaving this door open. Y'all got yeah, it. Stop leaving the door open. Come on, man. Get this up, baby. I hope he did. He did. I don't think it's poisonous. Yeah, he's a green snake. Poisonous snakes have bite. Yeah, I agree. I agree. <laughs> get that food up. I don't know why. Why y'all put the okra in here? Are those the dry ones? Can I see him? Ugh. Look at that snake guy. James, I thought it was a huge fat one. It was moving quick. The way he came running like it was a big one. Oh, it doesn't even have a mouth. Yeah, he's some ugly thing. Mm -hmm. Let me see his face. Use a dead one. Where do you put this at? Ugh. Where do you want this at? Oh well. You it's kill him and do what? Put the head there. So another one will not come back. The spirit will. Oh really? That we do that since. Where the head at? Oh, so they cut the head. This is what they do. And you bury it in front of the house and another one won't come. Wow. I never knew that. I'm learning. He's still moving without a head. What the heck? <laughs> I bet you won't try that no more. Jumping up in this house. <laughs> Get out of here. Use a dead. That was a great takedown. I'm ready for the next one. Ha! Thanks, Sunshine. Look what they're doing, babe. All the way to Dalton. That's your son. I'm gonna pat this here. I'm glad James uh, found that, but y'all better be careful with leaving this door open. Raheem was just right here. That's him doing the thing. Yes, he's a city boy. He don't know nothing about this here African thing. <laughs> and James, and James ran, huh? It was already open. But when it's raining, if you're coming over here during the rainy season, like Sunshine said, you have to keep them closed. Oh well. Look at that bag. That's your son. Welcome back. Welcome back, guys. Y'all saw that. Uh, Ugly snake. Ugh. You always got them snakes in there. Trying to get in or something. They don't know what they get into. That's ugly snakes. Ugly snakes. But we got some beans over here growing, guys. Look at that. I don't even know how to get in here. We didn't plant beans over here. I guess they said they're coming from the, um, the poop. The cow poop. The horse poop or whatever poop it is. They out here. We got some tomatoes coming in too, guys. We have planted more tomatoes, and they are coming. Well, that was a little skinny, little snakes. I hope ain't no more around here, because I ain't even got no shoes, but, I mean, no boots. <laughs> but these vine tomatoes are coming in here. I see, I see a few red ones over here. Didn't change. Y'all see them? So many. They came in quick this time. Let's see. I don't want to step on no snakes or get by no snakes if I have to stomp them. Just step them out. Tap, tap. Tap it out, guys. Y'all know what I mean. Yeah, these tomatoes are coming. So, when rainy season over, or almost over, we're going to have a lot of tomatoes, guys. I don't want to step in this here mud. Look at these little beauties. They are coming in here. We got to get some spray. The spray on them. We still got monsters in some spots. I tried to call you, Miss Loretta, if you watching this video. She called me last night and wanted some, some things. And I tried to call her today while I'm here to see what she wants. But... <clears throat> You didn't answer, so you're going to have to either wait till Monday. This tomato's all over the place. Monday, or call me back and let me know what, what do you need. But, 
Jeez, look at all this bisat, bisat, bisat. Still growing, everything still growing, growing, growing. More tomatoes, more getting, getting. We call them coriander leaves or corianders. There's a pile over here, right there. And they're good in the, the dishes that they make here. They're very delicious. We even got some. Ooh, let me go look at this callaloo over here. I might just take these. Please, no snakes. No snakes. I don't have on any boots. The snakes come out, they say, during the time, rainy season time, and the guys left the door open. I think it was right here. See, this is something we didn't plant here, but these are callaloo. God, these things are so good. Not a much, but this medicine tree just everywhere this year. Y'all see all those tomatoes? That's a beauty right there. Tomatoes, the ladies got rice growing. We got beets growing. We got some of everything that we need is growing. Or what we want is growing. After rainy season, we'll put a lot more other things in, in the ground. I didn't see where the ladies put the y'all this stuff here is good too i remember when we first got here they introduced this to us and sunshine that's working with us right now in the house putting up the ceiling he introduced us to us and he showed us how to make sauce with that and it was good too i must say you could never go hungry here in in the Gambia or Africa, period. If you know what you're doing in life. <laughs> and I mean it, guys. If you know what you're doing in life. And I mean in your business. Nobody else's business but yours. When you tend to yours, you winning, baby. So don't let nobody tend to yours and ain't tending to theirs. Otherwise, they will lose. But these are the rest of the cucumbers. They are planting more. <clears throat> and I think I see some squash over here growing. Well, at least one is old. Now, that's an old cucumber. So I haven't seen no more squash. We didn't plant many of those, but it is over with that cucumber. I think the lady said leave it up for right now, and they will take care of it later. They're going to put some on the other side, too, so... We can have more. I don't know what that is right there, but I know it's something look like b sap or what have you, but everything still looks good to me. I mean, it's doing what it's supposed to do. And that's what we want it to do. Hey, look at those clouds, guys. Ooh, there, look at that, look at that. Like I said, when other people know what you're doing in your business, something you're not doing right. Especially when they know more than you do. If they know more than you, you're not doing right. So never let anybody else know more, know more what you're doing in your own business. All your finances, anything. When they know more than that, something you're not doing right. But until then, guys, peace, love. Here comes Mr. Rick. Everything okay? Yep. Okay. I'll see you in the field. We got some visitors. These little things here. Just all over the place. Refuse to leave. Every time we come here, they want to sit in here. But it's all good. Let me go in here and relax until Raheem go. And uh, we'll be checking out. We have a, another, a per, another person that come to visit us. But we're going to go. And meet them in a different place. That it's bad because they don't have a uh, they regular driver. So we told them we can meet them in town, and that's what we're doing. But like I said, if a person knows more than your more about your business than you do, then something is wrong. You're doing something wrong because you are in charge of what's going on in your life. And everything and all the way around with life, period. You're the head. And don't let nobody change that for you guys. 
Love you, bag supporters. And we'll talk in another video. We are heading our way out for the weekend. Leaving bag. And Mr. Rick is taking it. He had it in there. Huh? It was in there. What? It was in four wheel. No, it was all. Oh, he was checking to see if Raheem left it in four wheel drive. So that's what we're doing. But we're on our way back to the city in Bidjalo. Or Kurt Serene or whatever you want to call it. But we're leaving. We have just left back and on our way back. We will see you guys when we see you. I just love that look to us. Clouds. Mother Nature is just beautiful. Especially in Africa on the continent. It is just really beautiful. Amazing. Get off here, guys. Y'all can tell that view there right there just too beautiful. Too beautiful. Bye. I love you, bag family. That's it for today. Hey, and over here, guard. It's Friday, probably. I don't know. That's his brother, isn't it? Mm -hmm.